there's two compartments, right? There's the blood glucose, there's the body glucose, which is the storage. So if you take that blood glucose and you simply shove it into your liver, take all that glucose, shove it into your liver, okay? What's going to happen? Well, your storage compartment is going to increase and your blood glucose is going to decrease. That's what you told the body to do. So if your storage is full, so type 2 diabetes, storage is full, it's overflowing, all this glucose is overflowing out of the body into the blood. Now you take this, this insulin, this drug, and remember this is a standard medical practice, practiced by every single sort of specialist in the world for the last 40 years. They say, wow, your blood glucose is too high. Your body glucose is also too high, but they're only looking at the blood glucose. So they said, we need to lower it. We can lower it by taking the blood glucose and shoving it back into your liver. It's like, okay, but you haven't <laughs> fixed the problem because the problem was that your liver was overflowing. That was the whole problem. Worse, because the liver is going to take this glucose that you now shoved into the, glu into the, into the liver, turn it into fat, right? So you take insulin, you gain weight because that's we know that's a main side effect of insulin because that's what you're telling the body to do. Insulin tells your body to store more glucose. So you gain weight. As you gain weight, what happens to your type 2 diabetes? Well, it gets worse. Then you take more insulin. Then what happens? You gain more weight, which makes your diabetes worse, which makes your blood glucose higher, right? So the whole process, you're making things worse because you never fix the underlying problem. What you should have done was get people to lose weight, not gain weight. If you have too much glucose in the body, there's only two things you want to do to get rid of it. You either put less glucose in, or you let your body burn it off. So if you let your body burn it off, say you use intermittent fasting, or say you use you lose weight, the diabetes get better, which means that you need less drugs.